Oh, don't mind me. I was just in my back cave, playing on my computer, uh, leaning back on my chair, doing gadgets. Don't mind me, I'm I'm Batmeg. Uh, hey, <laughs> welcome back to Batman Telltale with me. Um, last time we finished episode one, sorry. One of my bangs is not like the other. It is longer and gets in my eyelashes. Uh, <laughs> I'm in a weird mood. So we finished episode one, so we're gonna start episode two today. Very exciting. And if I'm correct, if I'm correct, that's my girl. That's my girl and that's Bane. And this hopefully won't be a disaster. I get weak with Harley Quinn, you know, and get weak in my knees. Double trouble with John Doe and Harley Quinn. I got some black tea, some chai. Chai with vanilla. Plain, no milk or sugar. Oh yeah, uh, what's her face? Waller knows that we're Batman. A madman from Gotham's past Bruce. returned to terrorize my city. He drew me into his twisted game, striking at the things I hold most dear. But I survived his deadly traps. I emerged the victor. But the cost was too great. Lucius Fox is dead. Riddler is dead. And with him, the only lead I had to taking down the greatest danger Gotham has ever faced. And the person best equipped to help me is a threat to my deepest secret. The Riddler was going to be my way in, once we captured him alive. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line, and knows exactly when to cross it. Hmm? Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce Wayne. It didn't... Uh registered that she's blackmailing him like that i just was scared first thing but that's blackmail know, like you have to work I with me keep your secret and despite what you did going behind my back to maury i will continue to keep it no reports nothing no one else needs to know to deal with the present threat though i need both of you oh. the man inside and outside you have to understand, I'm not the enemy here. I mean, I believe that. It may seem that way right now, but I'm not. Our problems are far too big for us to be bickering among ourselves. You shouldn't see me as an adversary. If that's true, then reinstate Gordon as commissioner. Hm. You really are loyal to that stubborn old mutant, aren't you? This is all I'll about friendship. You. Play nice with me now, and when this is all over, I'll make things right with Gordon. Okay, that's that's a good when motivator for me. Here, he's dead. They ain't gonna just carry on, carrying on. They might get sloppy. They might want revenge, or they might simply accelerate their plans. I'm gonna need eyes everywhere in Gotham. A man like Bruce Wayne. Amanda Waller booby shot. <laughs> can go places, Batman. But why is it that angle? You understand what I'm saying, don't you? Your public persona could be a great help to us here. Maybe even as much as Batman in certain situations. I, it, they are useful. I know when to be Batman and when to be Bruce. It's the mask that fits best at the time. Yep. Tactical. Now you're speaking my language. Can I romance her? What the oh, hell? Just <laughs> There's an explosion, Megan. Looks like the whole city's under attack. We've got a report of a raid on the Gotham PD arsenal. Who's doing that? Those bastards get their hands on our weapons. This is coordinated. It's Riddler's gang. It has to be. But he's done. We're going to need Batman for this one. Agreed. Emergency services is already pushed to the limit. Then we'll have to redeploy patrol officers to defend the arsenal. Don't divert any men, Gordon. I can handle the arsenal call. And also, okay, so he's still working within the police department. He just got demoted. 
Let's move, people. This is what we train for. There's been an attack in the financial district. Okay, I'm feeling better. Suicide Squad hasn't happened yet. Hopefully she isn't the major enemy. What if she's like staging stuff like this? I don't think she would. I don't know. What you came for. You don't need me. No. I'll live your usefulness and the boss will make a pretzel out of your neck. Whoa. Oh, you can do oh, it with a battery? I don't know. Ten or twelve, maybe. The really big one. He he made me give him the keys to the armored transport vehicles. I didn't want to, I swear. It's okay. Get out of here. Now. Thank you, Batman. Hey, you about done? Yeah, yeah, just about. All right. The Batman. Boss, we got company! Who, 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 Bane? Who are you? A nightmare. Much like yourself. A smash! You can call me Bane. Ah, smash! Oh! Oh, I got distracted. Oh my god, I love him! <laughs> yes, King! He's hey, like man, the Spanish fighter. Get war alone. alone i'm gonna be you real that well. one i i pressed but a first i don't know why it didn't penalize alone. me you will die alone that's a sweet uh. sentiment uh. he just wanted to touch his butt <laughs> uh. we're doing a lot of disarming Oh my god, his tattoos! Oh, the needle marks. I can see why Riddler wanted to be the one to kill you. Riddler is dead. He's dead? Yeah, Riddler? You should be worrying about yourself. I promised my men a hell of a battle if ever I faced you. And I'd hate to disappoint you. I love his mustache and his oh, beard. I haven't faced a true warrior since I left Peña Duro prison. because I wanted to hear him talk. Don't break me back! Save your strength, man. This one is mine. Uh-oh. Oh, no. You go in the same place every time? You could do a different side. Oh. I'm scared. Oh my god. Ooh, that's called gymnastics. I will give you a piece for death if you take it. I'll take it. Wait, what? Oh! Please don't die, I love my gang! Don't bring me back! Don't bring me back! Don't do it! This pain you're feeling. 
feeling, Batman. I want to hear what he has to say, but I also am afraid about the quick time events. No! Oh my god, this game knows. This game knows we're gonna freak out if Bane ever takes us over his head like that. We're gonna panic, because we know what happened. The come down. So perfect. Okay, he's breathing. Right? It's so perfect that they. The GCPD should be able to quickly find the stolen weapons. But Waller will feel disrespected for superseding her authority. Waller's people are well trained and equipped to deal with Bane's men and safely recover their weapons, but Gordon is bound to feel betrayed. I gotta call my bestie. I don't care. Like, I just don't care. Batman? I can't. Batman, like, what's wrong? <laughs> oh. It's on the way. really sad in that moment he's just like that that civilian that worker he's not something larger than life they're in that together underneath the rubble but i love that they brought in bane for this because so Batman. far this season has been about friendship to me and bane is like you can't fight alone Batman. safe travels my friends Say like he likes the it. group aspect Gordon Christ Batman Come on, help me It won't move Batman We're gonna need you to help us push this thing off you Come on You can do it It's moving Oh, Come on. Please don't be dead, the other guy. The mechanic. Where is he? No. He didn't make it. Damn it. He saved my life. Batman? It's okay, Jim. They just need a minute. Oh. Well, when you're feeling up to it, I'd love to hear what the hell happened here. He has to take a second to mourn the guy. To <laughs> he called himself Bane. His men loaded the weapons onto the APCs, said they were taking them to a warehouse near the docks. You need to find them. Don't worry. We'll catch the bastards. You better believe the entire force is motivated after what happened tonight. He's gonna be These mad at me, but just declared war on our city. Be sure to loop in Waller. She can help you. I already did. Nice. Okay, GG. Didn't GGs. have a choice. Yeah. Now that Waller's my superior, I have to loop her into everything. We're on the same page, me and Gordon. Uh, give us a second, will you? I just. Batman will always be my hero because, like, he just met Thanks that for guy. Sticking your neck out and calling me with this. But he's so affected by his death. Need like all the juice I me, can like get us. Now that we live in Waller's Gotham. We're going to have to stick together if we're going to weather her storm. You and me, we're nothing like her. We're men of principle who still believe in the letter of the law. I will always have your back, Jim. Thanks, Batman. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Oh my god. This is so... This keeps getting better Thanks and better. Thanks again for keeping me in the loop. It means a lot. 
<laughs> so sweet. Right on time. I'll get to the Batcave. See if I can make some sense of what happened tonight. So, what did I miss? Oh, I was at the scene of a heist at the Gotham Brokerage House when Batman called me here. What were they after? We're still getting a full account. Once the dust settles, I'll send you everything we've got. Detective Bullock's writing up a full report. I'll have him send you a copy. Officers are Bullock? ready for your deployment orders. Where's Bullock? Show me him. I've got to get going. Your partner, Avesta. How is she? Still in the hospital. And doctors say the hearing damage could be permanent. Damn it, it should have been me. I failed her. I put her in danger. It's my fault. Hold on to that anger. You'll need it. Avesta says anger can be productive if you put it to good use. She's right. Look, I owe you one for saving my life back there. So I gotta warn you. Waller flipped when she heard you called Gordon instead of her. Uh, what is this middle really school? You should stay on Waller's good side for as long as you can. For everyone's sake. Gordon is my best friend. Do you know anything about best friends? Well, tell Avesta you asked about her. Thank you. Oh my god. Alfred, yeah. Prep the med bay. Oh. We're going to need it. I bet Alfred hates to get voicemails like that. <laughs> He's probably his blood pressure skyrockets. You know. Okay, that was such a good intro. Oh my god, I'd be so excited to play this as it comes out. I'm, I'm fine. Really. You are not fine, Bruce. <laughs> None of this is fine. You were nearly killed tonight. Those minutes of silence, waiting for you to respond, they were the worst of my life. I'm sorry. I know if you're alive or dead, or if, if I would ever see you again. I'm so sorry to put you through that, Al. You'll just do it again tomorrow? Aww. We already lost Lucius. That's like an addiction. I couldn't bear losing you, too. Uh, uh, we, we can talk about all this later. Come on now. Let's get you patched I just up. I feel like it's hard, too, because he needs a whole ass medical team. Alfred. Oh, he's like doing work while he's getting patched up. Can relate. As if he wasn't bad enough. Now Director Waller knows your identity. That information in her hands? Waller isn't the one we need to worry about. Bane is still on the loose. With enough guns to arm a small militia. Oh, I... I understand. The man died for you tonight, Bruce. Trying to save you from that monstrosity. Yep. Too many have died. In too short a time, the cost of this war, it just continues to rise. Alfred, we will get through this. You know that, right? This storm will pass. Yes, I, I know that, Bruce, and I'm sorry for not being my resolute self. Oh my it's gosh, just do not apologize. Apologize. We've never seen this kind of destructive yeah. power before. It's really scary. Waller was right about one thing. Riddler was just a small part of a larger threat. Let's begin with the dart I pulled from his neck. There's so much I love about this Bane, guys. Yeah, got it? I love that it shows oh, the marks Thanks. of the needle. I love that it shows the come down. I love that yeah. it leans There's into that. Toxin left in what's here. that, Luchador? What kind of toxin? Something new. There's a whole series of powerful psychoactive meds in this cocktail. Wait, that's not Drugs Venom, that right? When combined. Who could have come up with such a concoction? And did Lazarus. the same person <laughs> pull the trigger? Okay. Bane's attack was one of three tonight. 
all at the same time. Let's bring him up. Get an assessment of the damage. 100% know that everyone's going to be like, you were thinking about this way too much. Just play the game. I just want to say it'd be really cool. I don't know where Avesta went, but if she actually is Talia and like that's a huge twist, then what if she shot it and it is something to do? I feel like isn't Venom sometimes akin to like Lazarus Pit material or maybe not? Uh, it's like a special kind of drug. But if she is like, like working for Raish, her dad, Roz, I'm gonna let that go. I'm gonna let that go. Uh, Gothcorp. Gothcorp Labs, genetic research facility. Where do we even start with this? Yes. I have no idea. Authorities can't determine what was even stolen until all of that melts. At least 20 dead, some completely encased in ice. The others were frozen solid. Some of their limbs shattered as they fled. Waller's intel shows that the thieves made off with numerous pieces of equipment used in the storage and transportation of biological material. Mm. I don't even want to think biological. What that for. So it could no be ideas Lazarus. on any suspects, though. Security cameras frozen. All witnesses dead. Gotham brokerage, ten million in diamonds stolen. Some safety deposit boxes emptied. Contents unknown. Selena wants to Over a dozen dead. have some Even of those diamonds. Wicked. Mostly by gunshot, though some victims had their heads smashed in. Oh, that's Bob Barrick. Who did that? Not Harley, right? Oh, wait, no. She's got her hammer. I think it could be Harley. Witnesses place Harleen Quinzel at the scene, dressed up as a clown and wielding a mallet. Don't ask me. <laughs> Ridley's friends are as insane and gruesome as he was. Hey! Perhaps even more. Those Don't talk about her! <laughs> say that she acted alone. All that carnage. All by herself. Okay, now I'm scared. Yeah, me too. Me too. Okay, let's look at... Ooh, okay. Um... Gordon promised that what happened at the harbor won't change anything between us. I'm not so sure. Waller pinned the blame for the Riddler's death and the abduction of her agents on Gordon. She used it as an excuse to strip him of his position as police commissioner. Now she's taken over the GCPD. I can't help but wonder if I could have stopped it. Gordon trusts me, but I couldn't save his position. I won't forget that. Montoya is a valuable ally, and it means a lot to me to have an officer of her caliber in my corner. I'm not sure how she feels about Bruce Wayne, however, especially after I went to question Maury. Um, the way it just says, deceased. Lucius is gone. He died in an explosion at Wayne Tower, helping me solve Riddler's puzzle. Loyal friend to the end, his last words will always haunt me. That psycho Riddler was responsible for his death, and I will stop at nothing to avenge him. John Doe, my boyfriend. I never thought I'd see John's face again until he showed up at Lucius's funeral. Evidently, he lists me as his emergency contact when he was discharged from Arkham. Could he be stalking me? He wanted me to meet some of his new friends. I accepted his invitation. He was already making a scene at the funeral. I just wanted to keep him from flying off the handle. Something good did come out of our conversation. John gave me a solid lead on Riddler's location that pointed me to an abandoned water tower in Gotham's East End. Could John Doe and the Riddler really be connected? And if so, how? I love him. I'm not my father's son. Wait, why did it show me that? Lucius's funeral didn't go well. Tiffany naturally had questions about her father's death, specifically if Riddler's contraption had anything to do with it. So I told her the truth. I owed her an honest ex explanation. But in this case, honesty was not the best policy. <laughs> she blew up at me, threatening to dig deeper into what Lucius and I were doing. Maybe I should get in front of that. 
Egypt Blake informed me his partner, Agent Avesta, is in the hospital, recovering from the traumatic hearing loss she suffered at the hands of Riddler. I can't help but blame myself for her solution. I know that the circumstances were impossible. It was the lives of three agents for Avesta's hearing, but that doesn't excuse the part I played in changing her life. I mean, good for you, Bruce, because I don't take responsibility. I, I mean, yeah, it's their lives. Like, it's people's lives and you're hearing. Okay, I know I said I would drop it and let it go, but what if she's Talia and what if she's lying about her hearing loss? Okay, I'm letting it go now. Waller confessed to knowing my true identity. This might prove to be dangerous, especially if I choose not to cooperate with her. She warned me to share with her all new information I uncover. I didn't follow up <laughs> her up on instructions to keep her in the loop when I decided to call Gordon instead of her after the attack on the GCPD arsenal. I don't know how badly this may shake her. Confidence in me, something I'd like to avoid, considering the leverage she could use against me. Vernon! The Riddler ambushed agents Blake and Avesta at the docks, using them as bait for me in one of his sick games. In an attempt to save his partner, Agent Blake pleaded with me to lose in order to save Agent Avesta's life. I couldn't do that. Agent Blake narrowly survived his encounter with the Riddler, though I'm not sure if he'll forgive me for allowing his partner to lose her hearing in the process. Eli remains in police custody and refuses to give up any information about the Riddler, his plans, or his allies. It's unclear if Eli stays silent out of loyalty or fear. Deceased! The Riddler ambushed Agent Avesta and her team at the docks in an elaborate trap. He forced me into playing one of his games in exchange for their lives. In the end, I managed to outsmart him, but at a heavy cost. Before we could bring him in for questioning, Riddler was mysteriously killed with a poison dart to the neck. All I have now are his cryptic last words. They broke the pact. But who are they, and why did they want him dead? The pact. I decided to pay Mori a visit at his casino where he was being kept under the watchful eye of the agency. He admitted to selling Riddler the missiles that he had been using to target his enemies. In exchange for giving up Riddler's location, Mori demanded I pay for his escape out of the country. I refused to help Mori escape justice and took the intel on Riddler by force. I may have made an enemy of him, but he won't be up to hitting back anytime soon. I have to work with the agency now or risk Waller exposing my identity. With Riddler gone, their main target appears to be the group of international criminals he was the ringleader of. A new class of criminals has converged on Gotham. According to Waller, they're the best of their kind and the most dangerous. John Doe, the Riddler. So, why do they know that it's John Doe? Oh, wait, because he said he knew the Riddler. It would just be really interesting if Waller's already kind of setting up this group or like she's trying to set up the Suicide Squad. Um, but this is so different. Like, I can't really predict. Same with Vicky being Lady Arkham. That was crazy. <laughs> Waller used her political clout to take over the GCPD. She won't let police procedure get in her way. Gotham Citizen Support, GCPD Batman Partnership. Yes. I read that. Guns? Money? Biotech? What are they planning? We won't know until we get to Bane. I don't mean to cause offense, but you're in no shape to beat the information out of that monster. Or take on his friends, if it comes to it. We've already seen how formidable Bane is on his own. Taking on all of them, that would be suicide in your current condition. Of course I could use help. But both the GCPD and the agency are stretched thin. One thing's for sure. We can't just wait around for Bane Remember to strike what? again. The death toll is already too high. You told Waller you knew when to be Batman and when to be Bruce. Riddler said his friends abandoned him at the Lady of Dublin. He alluded to the fact that John Doe was one of them. If that's the case, then John can get you He's got such a cute others. smile, John Doe does. He already wants you to meet them. John Doe might be your best chance of getting inside, finding out what they're up to. You're right. John's my ticket in. 
If I play my cards right, John might tell me most of what I want to know. Uh, well, the less you have to mingle with his friends, the better I'll feel about all this. But you like John? Dangerous approaching <laughs> Dane and his people this way. They'll be suspicious of anyone who isn't a proven criminal. You'll have to give the performance of a lifetime to pull the wool over their eyes. Bruce Wayne has influence, an endless bank account, and as of last year, questionable integrity. <laughs> yeah, I punched Everything twice. Everything the criminal network looks for. Punched Penguin twice. Yeah. So that's it then. I find John Doe and accept his offer. And not gonna lie, I'm like really good at lying. <laughs> I've been pretty good at lying in this season. Excellent news. <laughs> Alfred's like, what does colon D mean? <laughs> stacked deck. The stacked deck. Get it, Joker? That's where he is. I suppose you couldn't wait an hour or two. Right, like a nap? Rest. A power nap? Not a chance. Ay ay ay. You could have had a power nap. You could have drank some coffee, fell asleep for 30 minutes. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god. Batman! I'll tell you about Batman. He's no hero. Boy, I oh, see him. looking cute! He's just a bunch of hired muscle for rich guys. His face lit guys up. Guys like Bruce Wayne. I see. I'm on a date. Really? Tell Bruce Wayne how that makes you feel. Oh my god, I love his yeah. outfit. Okay. Who's that? It feels no, really. He's on your right. Feels like crap, Wayne. Preach! And you're just a huge, colossal, gigantic, spoiled <laughs> piece of. Is he trying to uh, replicate uh, Arkham uh, Asylum? Uh, uh, I mean, uh, uh. Go on. Finish what you were gonna say. I was gonna say you're a coward. Who lets other people do his dirty work? But you get away with it all. Nothing bad ever <laughs> happens to Bruce Wayne. Oh. The whole dead parents thing. Oh, my buddy Bruce, rescuing uh, me. Uh, don't mind Willie. We're just messing with you. You look like you could use a drink. I love the one purple button. That's such a cool choice for his. Outfit. Oh. Bottles under my chair, Willie. Who said that? Oh, Waller. I uh, I run a therapy circle here every second. That Sunday. is so sweet. These people need <laughs> the expertise that I learned in Arkham. And it brings you stability. Oh, and it makes sense then if he is uh, tied with so, Arlene romantically. That know it all really got what was coming to him. Authorities are refusing to comment on the death of the mysterious criminal known as Riddler. Who am However, I? Who am I? You're a rotting, stinking corpse. That's who you are. <laughs> John, did you have anything to do with the Riddler's death? I mean, I hated the guy, but... Jeez, Bruce. You really think I'd be capable of cold-blooded murder? After yes. everything you know about but... me, you really think I'd do that? No, 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 of course not. I mean, I know you hated him, but, you know, killer. What was I thinking? I know what you were thinking, but hey, no harm done. Well, I don't think he's anyway, done it yet. I was Look at his butt! Surprised to see you, Bruce. <laughs> I'm guessing this is about that favor I asked. Yeah, and I just wanted to Look, catch up. Look, before we get into that, I need to come clean. Riddler was more connected to my friends than I'd let on at the funeral. Riddler? Really? Yeah, he was kind of our leader, but he was just so bad at it and so <laughs> in 
intolerably annoying. <laughs> I thought he'd be out of the picture by the time you came around. I should have told you. I just I didn't want you to think we were all like him. Oh. No secrets between us. Ever again. You have my word. I pinky swear. That's cute. I'll pinky swear. I'm just waiting to see if he'll say something. <sighs> pinky swear. Friends for life. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. At this point, he just right, looks weird. The that's guys. the thing that's sad to me. It's like oh, everyone is judging him life. right now. It's just because he's socially awkward. <laughs> Why? I'm out of medicine. Oh, that was the medicine. I, I thought like it was the green babies. stuff. I think you're bothering my friend, oh. John. I don't remember asking for you to join us, Billy. Go sit down. Sit down? You better stand up. Wait. Nobody what? disrespects <laughs> me. No one's making a fool out of Willie. Not even you, John. Stay away from him. Perfect. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely violence. Well, also that helps because we have to prove that we're. Really had a problem, and we took He got his him. knife out. Is he dead? I said we took care of him. Um, it helps All with right, the illusion Felicia. that you know Bruce him. Wayne is unhinged and <laughs> can be in the pact or whatever. If that's the pact that he was talking about. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he little squeak girl. <laughs> Just best friend things. Oh, cool. They're expecting you. Yeah, I think they sent that. He sent that to them, and it'll Bruce, um, help. <laughs> one, one more thing. You can't tell anyone this. This is big, huge. I think I'm in love. It's it's an odd feeling. I'm not saying with me. At first. I some kind of disease, but uh, no, I think it's love. It's not me, and I'm, I'm really so sad. I'm so happy, John. You deserve the best. Yeah, I'd blush if I could. And it's not Bruce. It's hard. So mysterious. You at least gotta tell me your name. She'll, she'll, she'll want to introduce herself, but uh, if you could please help me look good in front of her. I'd appreciate it. Okay. Come on. We shouldn't keep her waiting. I'm not gonna lie, like my heart dropped as Bruce that he's in love with someone else. <laughs> Almost got it. God damn it, I thought I had it. Here, uh, give me a hand with this, will you? I'm pretty sure this is how you get this thing started. Come on, come on, come on. At least it worked before. No, oh, look, you're doing it wrong. Red's the battery, yellow's the starter, spark one on the other. You are literally my hero, Bruce. <laughs> oh. I mean, wow. Oh. Don't turn around. All right. You got my attention. Give me one good reason oh, why I don't redecorate the windshield with your noodle. Oh my god, I don't trust her at all. I bet a smart guy like you has some real pretty brains. Real bright. Harley. Stay out of this pudding. Grown-ups are talking. Well, you got a reason I shouldn't put a bullet in your noggin? Well, if you know who I am, then you probably know I'm more useful alive. That makes sense. Sense is so boring, though. What about money, power, and influence? 
they bore you too? No. Those are fun. Wait, are we gonna be a thruple? I'm just Josh and your rich boy. Are we See, gonna be a thruple? There wasn't even a bullet in the chamber. Oops. <laughs> Oops. I love her makeup. Let's put some music on. And it's like a corset. That's so beautiful. Bruce, this is the lady I was telling you about. Harley Quinn. Hard eyes. Isn't she a hoot? Oh, he's so bi. I love I John. Well, trust me, I'm laughing my ass off on the inside. Well, come on, Bruce. Harley was just kidding. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You probably don't like things that go bang too much. Because of After my parents. That sad, sad way you lost your folks. Ah, because she's a therapist. Olivia says you're chomping at the bit to meet us. I want to get an idea why. What do you get out of rubbing shoulders with the likes of us? Well, when you have as much money as I do, you get bored. I'm just looking for a little excitement. Wait, 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 wait. Can I romance Harley? Mr. Silver Spoon needs some new toys. You, you should have seen the way he took care of business with the guy in the bar, though, Harley. He's a force to be reckoned with. Do us a favor, Pud. Skip over to that bodega and get me a slushie. A slushie! Right now? <laughs> Need a buck? <laughs> I got it. That's her drink of choice. That's so cute. Oh, he's a he's down bad. Aww. Oh, John. He just doesn't know who he is yet. You know. He's such Ooh, this is like power switch boy. because she's gonna turn him into the Joker. He thinks the world of you. So I asks myself, what's Bruce Wayne? want with a lost soul like John. It's kind of a mismatch. Raises all kinds of questions. John and I went through a lot in Arkham. He's a friend. Oh, ain't that cute. You're sweet on little old Puddin. Yep. Here's the thing, lover boy. Guys like him don't have friends like you. Why? You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. And I only like trouble when I'm the one causing it. <laughs> you got a good reason why I should trust you? Because I sure as hell can't see one. After all, you're a squeaky clean favored son of Gotham. How am I supposed to believe you won't run to the cops the first chance you get? You shouldn't. You can't trust anyone. Not in our line of work. Ain't that the truth? You're not what I expected. Still, you gotta show me you got what it takes to be part of our pact. Come on, why is everyone so hot? Oh, gee, thanks, Wood. We gotta oh go. Oh my god, that's so cute. Did you steal it? Did you steal it? You stole the slushy. Are you gonna run someone over? What were you guys talking about? You didn't about? run him over. Your friend was just saying how much he liked you, Pud. Got a little man crush on ya. Ain't that right, Brucie? We're gonna be a thruple. Ain't that the gist of it? Why would I back down from that? It's me. It's the truth. <laughs> you just made my <laughs> day, Bruce. <laughs> thruple, thruple, thruple. Feelings mutual. Is this a dating set? I'm so happy. Be careful. You drank it all? Oh my god. That is the best damn slushy. It's like Caleb. Ever. Caleb is Harley Quinn. I'm Joker. Suck on that. What was I that? I swear it'll make your whole oh. body shiver. Um, guys? Come on. What is happening? Put your I ain't got cooties. Cross my heart. Why is this so John? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I told ya. Of who? 
Of Harley? I'm confused. Okay, here's what's going to happen now, Mr. Moneybags. Is that bad? You're gonna go get Mama a little present. From inside there. Oh my god, she has so much power in this relationship. A little bird told me there's some pretty fancy hack and tech up there. Something called a phalanx key. Get it for me. I'll know you're on the level. Maybe I'll even bring you along on our next job. You'll get all the um, thrills you ever dreamed of. Couldn't I sabotage it? But what I don't do you know. Want with I the phalanx key? Why wouldn't I want it? I hear this thing opens half the security systems in Gotham. And it's just sitting there, hidden in your lab, waiting for someone to put it to use. <laughs> What's the matter? You better not try nothing fishy. I don't want to have to splatter that pretty face. It's in okay, face. Harley. And she will. Bruce and I already talked. He'll do whatever you want. Is that right? Will you do whatever I want? Will you jump when I say jump? Will you bring me the shiny things I ask for? Well, this is a complex task. There might be some bumps along the way. Nothing is guaranteed. Some things are. Like how fast I'll make you disappear if any of those bumps turn into trouble. What am I going to get in return? Wink, wink. Um, this is so Your trippy. She has all the power. The oh my god. It's not... But I've seen. I also love that the voice actor is and get me that using Arlene's and voice as. Mama really wants to get herself some tacos when you're done. Got this, Bruce. Um, Arlene's voice as like a template, you know, like as inspiration. But it's it's new. It's a new Harley voice. Because sometimes they just try to like replicate Arlene Sorkin, and you can't. You know, you you just can't. She's the OG. R.I.P. Um, but I really like this Harley for being different. But also the same in certain ways. Like she wants oh, tacos Wade. and slushies. Uh, yeah, if you could please sign in on account of the attack. What attack? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, um, what brings you in? I left something if, here. If you don't mind me asking. Is everything okay? Well, no rest for the weary. Yeah, or for the wicked. You're all set, sir. Okay. Why'd you say that? <laughs> I bet Waller has, like, people on the inside. If she goes and plans hey, something... Oh. This is private oh my... <laughs> Really ought to rethink your hiring practices, Bruce. Your man's lying down on the job. What did you do to him? Is he still alive? Don't worry. A little bop on the head never killed anyone. Okay, he's not dead. Going up, Brucey. You do know how an elevator works, don't you? I'm really scared of you her. Know? I'm genuinely I'm really, you. really scared of Good her. Boy. As long as you keep up this good behavior. And he can Even say he was taken time, hostage. Mm, I might have to go back and finish the job. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't a very good guard anyway. I mean, isn't he supposed to keep people out? Maybe getting knocked down will teach him a lesson. Did anyone see you do that? Uh, fancy joint like this probably has cameras. I hope they got my good side. Both of them are good sides. Thought you were gonna wait in the car. And Harley figured you'd want some company. Didn't want you to have to do this all by your lonesome. It's not gonna be. You don't have a problem with that, do you, Mr. Moneybags? Of course. Glad you could join me. Welcome to Wayne Enterprises. A oh, bruise! Sexy! <laughs> Thanks, sugar. Oh! <laughs> I'm making him oh, naughty, awesome. naughty. Kind of blue. Our place has way more personal. I will admit, like, you could do something with the elevator. It's not that say, pretty. Bruce, it's exhilarating to walk these hallowed halls with you. This is where the wheeling and 
dealing happens. The power plays, the boardroom scuffles. I can feel all that toxic energy involved. <laughs> you think I could run a place like this one day? Mm-hmm. Like you, Bruce? I think I'd get quite a kick out of being CEO. You think I could do it? If you keep your head down, work really hard, yeah, why not? Oh, yeah, you worked real hard. <laughs> That's true. You had a rich pops who stole everything not nailed That's down. true. Oh, come on, Harley. It's true. Bruce's father worked really hard at taking other people's money. That's true. Gotta give I him guess. credit for that. Yeah. <laughs> no, hey, no, 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 no. Pull it together, puts. All that slushy you drink has got you. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, Bruce, well, I'm surprised to see you. And these are... <clears throat> to whom do I owe the pleasure? I don't believe we've met. They're fashion consultants. I figured it's time I try out a new look. Not just Bruce. We're gonna revamp this whole place! Yes, yes. Dress everyone in snazzy uniforms. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, no one ran this by me. Oh, just, bitch. <laughs> you could come into I never really on liked Monday her. Dress just like me. I love his outfit, I'm gonna be real. Is this some kind of joke? And her outfit. Uh, uh, Do I look funny to you? You gotta be careful. Like I'm some kind of punchline or something. Excuse me? <laughs> You're gonna let your employees sass me like that? It was rude. Is this the kind of operation you run here? Your worker bees just mouth off whenever they want. I'm sorry, Harley. It won't happen again. That's for damn sure. There's no need for that. Ooh. I always said it won't happen again. We'll... We'll talk about this later, Bruce. <gasps> mm -mm. You got a firm grip, Mr. Corporation. The kind that makes a girl go weak at the knees. Wanna show me what else you can do with those hands? We could carve out some alone time. Just you and little old me. I don't know what to do. Anytime, anywhere. I can't resist her. Just say the word. Oh boy. It is getting I'm pain. sorry, no, no, John. No, 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 no. That's not what we're doing here. I'm sorry. We've got a job to do. Right I'm gonna here. I'm gonna create the Joker. Don't get your panties in a twist. It's by panic! <laughs> I'm having body panic, okay? I can't. Wait here. I can't I'm resist right. Harley. Forget it, Brucey boy. Your secret lab ain't really a secret. What? Cobblepot's got quite a mouth on him. I don't think he ever shut it the whole time I was working at Blackgate Prison. She was just like collecting all sorts of interesting stuff. Say, do you like chess? Work your magic. Tick-tock. What's the hold-up? But how do they know he's not Batman? Or how... What? Tight how do they not know? You know, I think you two are the closest friends I've ever had. Need to be careful, I think. It's just saying John is getting just oh. I present to you our secret lab. Lucius, you have seriously outdone yourself this time. <laughs> Glad you like it. Like it? Oh no, this this changes everything. It was, was getting a bit dodgy having all those batarangs oh. in the Wayne Enterprise R and D way. 
Thank you, Lucius. Come on. Now the real work starts. Oh. R.I.P. Hm. Somehow I was expecting more. Oh. Where's the giant crater? I thought this was where your friend went out with a bang. Wait, there's so many that was batterings. His upstairs. Better question. Oh, I thought Where's that was a battering. Key? How do they it not know that he's Batman? Well, what you waiting for, sweetie? Go get it. I thought the lights were battering. Like, I don't know. I was confused. Wait, what's this? Is that him and his... Oh, God. Put the hammer away, Harley. Put the fucking hammer away. So maybe I'll be able to do other stuff when I come back. I'm gonna be real. I don't know if I'll actually. My lock protocol vault thumbprint required Lucius Fox. That's not right. Why the lockout? Someone's been in here. What's taking so long, Bruce? It's saying it won't open without Lucius's thumbprint. And that got blown up with the rest of him, didn't it? Oh, all the dumb luck. You're saying we can't get it open then? Harley's not going to like that at all. Or you. L let me try to find latent prints around here with my scanner. Always thinking, this guy. Mm-hmm. Dinner to celebrate Tiffany's first day at Wayne Enterprises. I'm sorry you didn't make it there, Lucius. I didn't even get to do that. So sad. I remember when Tiffany brought that back from art class. <laughs> All right, that's a start. Nice. Getting there. Tiffany built that rocket herself. Lucius was so proud. I don't know about Tiffany in other iterations of Batman. I don't. How's the security guard? Okay, still unconscious. Yeah. Hope he's not hurt too badly. How would I help him? How would I have helped him? I don't know. This reminds me of like a high <laughs> One more school thing. Should do it. Like if if um the popular kids wanted to use a rich kid for like alcohol or something i don't know it just it feels just a bunch of old reports young you, you know to clean out teenagers not a single usable print he's so scared of her oh my god there we go Okay, this will work. Now that's a shiny piece of metal. What's it do? I'm not even sure if it works. It's an EMP generator, Puddin. <laughs> Tell them what it does. It emits a pulse that knocks out other nearby electronic devices. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to try that? Uh-oh. This whole thing is making me realize that how dangerous Harley would be if Keep she looking. wasn't down bad for Joker.
Please don't knock me out. Even now, still finding ways to help me. Stay there. Don't touch anything. I touch what I want when I want, Brucey boy. You knew what's best for you. You'd quit giving orders and find me that key. The thing is, I don't think Bruce is a bottom, so like, you're gonna have to deal with at l the very least a switch. Looking for this. <gasps> I told you I'd find out what you got my dad mixed up in. This, this is much worse than I thought. You're not safe here. Careful. You have to hide. What the hell are you doing with a secret zone full of weapons? I'm Batman. What's going on here, Bruce? What's all this for? Your father worked with Batman. That's who all this stuff is for. Batman. I know it. His tech. Dad's fingerprints are all over it. I came looking for answers, but... I didn't expect this. Bruce. These people you're with. I saw on the cameras what they did to that guard. To Regina. They'll do the same to you, or worse. Get out of sight. Bruce! What's taking so long in here, huh? She hid. Hey! I know oh, shit. you. We met at your father's funeral. John. Okay, Bruce. No need to get physical. I get it. We'll be as quiet as lab rats. But, but what about Harley? I mean, she's gonna want to know about your, uh, friend here. What am I supposed to tell her? You don't have to say anything to her, John. Okay? He's gonna spell her. It can be our secret. In Arkham, I was well known for my discretion. All the guards confided in me. Really? I don't oh. like lying to Harley, but I'll do it for you, Bruce. Oh. What I really need is the phalanx key. You give me that, I can go out there and, you know, make Harley happy. You can have the key. Just leave Tiffany out of it, okay? You mean this thing? Girl, please, please, please. You've please. got to be kidding, Bruce. You can't give these psychos anything from this life. Tiffany. Hey, now. That's not we nice. Need to get personal. We're all on the same side, remember? Come on, Bruce. You know how dangerous this tech could be in the wrong hands. Yoo-hoo! What the hell is going on in there? Please, Tiffany. I've been honest with you every step of the way. Yeah. Now I need you to trust me. Please. I better not see this on the evening news. Thank you. This this makes things so much better for everyone. Thank you, Tiffany. You made the right call. Harley will be over the moon when I show her this. Stay out of sight until we are long gone. Whatever. Bruce. You better know what you're doing. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Took you long enough. I was starting to think you got sucked into a portal to another dimension or something. Your boys did good, you know? Made Mama proud. Hmm. Huh. It don't look like nothing special. You got what you wanted. Now let's just get out of here. <laughs> Load that thing up too, John. <sighs> Hurry it up. What is happening? How is she? What? Oh. Bruce, are you all right? He's had to keep it together with his wounds. I'm fine, Alfred. Are you okay? I was keeping an eye on you over the security feed. Well, breaking into my own company was unexpected. Things could have gone so much worse. Yeah, that's that you true. managed to keep both John and Tiffany quiet was a masterstroke, Bruce. Masterstroke. Still. That young woman is smarter than both of us, Bruce. 
Harley or Tiffany? Oh, Tiffany. She puts the rest of the pieces together. So is that such a bad thing? I know you reveal that Lucius worked with Batman, but will that satisfy her? I want to tell her. She won't stop digging until she gets to the truth. Maybe we should just tell her. Yeah. I've always regretted not being more honest with you about your father's life. Don't make the same mistake I did. Mm. You're right. I'll be as honest yeah. with Tiffany as I can. Very good. Uh, with regards to tonight's other catastrophes, your night watchman got a nasty lump on the head, but don't worry. He'll be fine. I've already arranged for him to get a generous payout and an extended vacation. And nice. replace tonight's offending security camera feed with dummy footage. Alfred, yeah, yeah, what would I do without you? As for Regina, I'm afraid your fashion consultant's cover story is going to cause I just thought that problems. was cute. I don't know. She seemed to be Wasn't thoroughly smart, unsettled after your encounter. Well, after what went on, it'll be a challenge to smooth things over with her. It's all coming so fast. One thing after another. You need to take it easy, Al. Get some rest. It's only a momentary bit of exhaustion. I'm sure it will pass. He needs to retire. Bruce. I know we agreed there was no better way to get to Bane. But this whole adventure with John and Harley, well, frankly, it's exhausting. Yeah. <laughs> well, be careful and good luck. Please go to bed. It makes me nervous. I love him so much. <laughs> Those things will kill you. Consider quitting. Ah, uh, you sound like my daughter. I yeah. want to see Barbara in You're this. You're welcome. It's information. I thought it was a cigarette. <laughs> from sealed records we dug up at the coroner's office. Oh Harley my God. Committed suicide after decades of struggling with mental illness. Yeah, tough story. Gonzalo was a devoted, successful doctor. But she couldn't save her. Must have been hard on her. So what's the point? The trauma of her father's death oh my caused God. her breakdown. Turned her into the monster she is today. You know, I know what she's done, but I can't help but feel a little sorry for her. Yep, that's Harley for it's you. It's rough on a person going through all that. Yeah, the loss of a loved one can do that. But she's also incredibly scary, and I do would. think she chose. She chose. She chose. Let's make that clear. Oh, hey, Gordon, hey, hey, how y'all doing? This is still my goddamn station house. He's forgetting oh I'm the one God. who can never break his career. Right I'm in a love triangle here and love me triangle. In a Clearly, I need a better method of getting the message across. Batman got the memo. It's time you did. No, ugh, I just didn't say anything. Unbelievable. Come on! Ah, oh, fuck. I should have said She's stuff. got some kind of leverage on you, doesn't she? Yes. If she's jammed you up somehow, just say the word. I'll appeal to the mayor, the governor, whatever it takes that to get her off your work. back. I'll do whatever I can to help you. She knows who I am, Jim. Oh, yeah? Well, so do I. You're Batman. That's all you ever have to be. That's all Gotham needs you to be. And Aww. you, if you're threatening to take that away, you should be ashamed of yourself. Oh, Gordon. I don't Calm want to it. Hear it. Ooh. Just supposed to come to Gotham, put the chains on Riddler and his gang, and get the hell out. I'm just saying, this city gets under your skin fast. Know what I mean? Best laid plans and all that. I know exactly what. You know. 
This city has made me who I am. So I've heard. I just wish Gotham produced more Batmans and less Riddlers. Oh, you my like job me? A whole lot easier. Okay. Well, I guess you locals see it so my theory is wrong, unless Agent it's someone within she the force, you know, the agency. Wanted to see a real oh. neighborhood. Wanted to see you, her hometown hero. She wanted to impress you. She admires what you do for the people of this city. Your respect is important to her. Does she know who I really am? Who do you think told me who you are? <laughs> See, that's why I think it's Talia. For the Talia. world's greatest detective, you sure can be slow. So, Wayne Enterprises. Heard you made some new friends. Oh my god, I You're can't escape fall. her. Thanks to you, these very bad people have an EMP and a key that'll open every lock I But don't you want shut. me to be close They're to them? Planning something. Like the I saw the too high to leave anything to chance. You know, I actually considered asking you to infiltrate Riddler's gang. Yeah, I'm like this is Before right up your alley, girl. Up. Right up your cl I crime knew I alley. I count on you to get me close to them. Close to Bane. You're good at this. Seems like you've already won Harley Quinn's trust. You're gonna putting a tail on me jeopardizes the literally mission. call it off. You're right. I will. Hell yeah. Get them away from their base of operations. Somewhere they'll be exposed. When they're all together, out in the open, contact me. I'll be standing by, ready to ambush. We'll take them down when they're at their most vulnerable. What do you mean, take them down? You're Sound not gonna good? kill them, They'll right? They'll never know what hit them. Looping Gordon! No one gets... Ugh, Looping you Gordon. You need to involve Gordon. Don't tell me how to run my operation. His people know this city better yeah. than anyone. And they and have I don't their think hands filled will... other priorities right now. He won't let her... Batman. Kill them. If it gets bad for you, just remember. We're out here. When you're in deep like this, you need friends. <laughs> I have a lot of friends Let's right now. Let's say everything is pear and you get stuck in there longer than you'd like. Then what's right, what's wrong, it all gets blurry. <sighs> and guess what? That's okay. Because you're going to have to do some blurry things that you are not proud of before this is done. You hear me? That's just how these kinds of operations go down. I created Batman to strike fear into criminals, not become one. Batman's not the one rubbing shoulders with them at the moment. You should think about which one Gotham really needs right now. Oh, man. Yeah, I don't know. That's a good question. I'll have to think about that. <gasps> You're in! Well, I'm in. Just don't stay embedded any longer than necessary. I'll be in and out, Alfred. Just long enough to figure out their plans. Good luck, Bruce. Stay safe. I love you. Why don't they say I love you to each other? Is that new a newsy? <laughs> Is that newsy, Bruce? Here we go. Uh oh. <laughs> really? Why has it got to be so scary? Oh my god, please take the hat off. I can't. Well, you know what's interesting? Hey Christian Bale, Santa Welcome Fe, to our little Jack, home away from home. Batman, the end do you understand life. the link I'm making? We're happy to have you. Um, Thanks, John. It's a hazing. You said you'd kill him after you got what you needed. So what? Ain't a girl allowed to change her mind? Could someone get me out of these handcuffs, please? Tell me why I shouldn't. This is so cool. What I have is influence, and that is worth a lot. I'm getting choked by Bane. Spoken like a man who has never had to do hard work. <laughs> who the hell wants to do hard work? <laughs> I bring us back the transport and He's the arms scared we of require. Her. You. You bring I mean him. Worthless aristocrat. Oh. We don't need it. <laughs> aristocrat. Oh yes. Bane's a communist. Bane, how do you feel about Carl Marx? Overgrown bicep. 
already got us an EMP device and the failing ski. I'll betcha I can find a use for him. I do not care how much these two swoon over you, Wayne. <laughs> we don't want you here, and we don't need you here. Oh. Whoopsie. What the hell? <laughs> Turn it off! Turn it off! Now! Can you do something about this? It's freeze. Freeze is coming. Yes! What this is a freeze! Done? It was Mr. You need Freeze. to uncuff me. Don't screw this up. I won't. You fool! I can turn it off. Make it stop, or I will seal you both in ice! Um... Mr. Freeze. I swear, if you don't get that electricity back on immediately, I'll send you to a frozen hell. Uh, I don't understand what's happening. I hope there wasn't an order I was supposed to do it in. Wait, what? Guys, I didn't even look at the map. What the hell? Okay, see. So I was just pressing buttons, that's so funny. I love pressing buttons. Well, at least we know that it works. He winked at me, though. He planned it. I must check on Nora. See how she is. You may have impressed these two, but I haven't made up my mind about crushing your skull. Fair enough. Everyone back to work. Still a lot to get done. Who put you ha in charge? Hacienda. <laughs> Somebody has to give the orders. Okay, so Harley is not the leader of it all, but she is the leader of Bruce and John. That was a nice <laughs> job before. Come on up to my office. Oh. Um. What? <laughs> Listen, Bruce. I just want to clear the air a little. You distanced yourself from us back at your office. I don't blame you after all the trouble I caused. You probably noticed I like to stir things up. It's a bad habit. And, well, it's made me more enemies than friends. I want to say I'm sorry for messing with your people. Oh, your employees. The psychology certificate in the background. No apology necessary. All in good fun. Fun? You seemed pretty cut up about it at the time. I wouldn't blame you if you were mad, but I want you to understand. You've seen these animals I work with. In my business, you let your guard down for a second, you get torn to shreds. I can only imagine. If I'm always pushing buttons, it's to keep people off balance, you know? Keep them guessing my next move. Keep the real me hidden. Yeah. I hope you ain't gonna judge me for it. To be honest, I've been at it so long I don't even notice I'm doing it. It's just a part of who I am. We all wear masks, Harley. You don't have to be a criminal for that. Even you? You ain't like these others. Bane's a powder keg. Freeze. <laughs> well, you saw Freeze. John's sweet. And believe me, he's got heaps of potential. But he's still a growing boy. You, though, you got your head screwed on right. You're reasonable. I can work with reasonable. What? We're pulling a job tonight. I want you to be a part of it. You already showed you know how to use that EMP better than any of these other clowns. I want you to come with. A job? Sounds intriguing. What's the target? I like you, Brucey, but I never give up all my secrets on a first date. It's need to know, and you don't need to know. All will be revealed eventually. Okay. Using that EMP, though, 
That's gonna make tonight's job a whole lot less messy. And that no-neck asshat Bane, he loves making a mess. <laughs> people getting killed just makes his day. But you smushed if you're people's gonna come heads in. You gotta convince the others. Convince them? It's a real pain in the ass sometimes, but you need a majority opinion for anything big. And bringing you along, well, you got some persuading to do. Let me know how I can help. So what's the deal with Freeze? He's... unique? You mean why he's blue and wrapped up in machinery? Accident in the lab. Here's the thing about Freeze. Only thing he gives two hoots about is his wife. <laughs> he gave up everything to try and save her when she got sick. And I mean everything. Job, health, soul, the whole shebang. She's dead? Frozen stiff. Keeps her on ice in the next room while he searches for a cure. Ain't that just kooky? I mean, it explains why he flipped when the EMP went off. But seriously, who does that? I doubt his wife would approve if she realized what he's become. She'd probably never want to wake up, exactly. <laughs> so he'd be better off not getting what he wants. You can say that again, but he might not want to hear it. Mm -hmm. Talking about his wife is the only way to get Freeze to pay attention to you. Thank you. But watch yourself. His attention ain't always a good thing. Yeah. Um, she's like especially scary in this to me because, you know, having that psychology, it's like a, a doctorate, right? I can't really tell. But having that certificate in the background you know, I can't tell when she's really being honest or when she's manipulating me because I've known therapists and psychologists, psychiatrists who are actually like abusers in real life and with their family and like really, really smart people can be manipulators, like really good ones because they know how to get to you. So it's just scary. I get the feeling Bane doesn't like me very much. That knucklehead respects strength and loyalty. Show me got those. Doctor, yeah. Around. He's a man's man. I don't got much time for all that burly machismo, but sit him down for a beer or something. He'll hear what you gotta say. He may kill you when you're done, but at least he'll listen. I don't know if I should say that. I really don't know because. I just don't think I should say that. I'll go talk to the others. See what I can do to change I their feel lives. like that would I've got freak faith her out. You, handsome. Like, yeah, I don't know why I would say that. Welcome, Bruce. Who made that banner? That's so cute. Spirit of unity? Not really what I'm sensing from this group. <laughs> I love his boots. He's trying to look like a blue collar worker, dude. sort through all this Not with him watching me I heard about hey. your wife and I <laughs> hear me out I oh. will be able to help what do you mean you'll answer me if you're smart and understand the concept of self-preservation I know it's like to lose a loved one. I can't imagine anyone knowing anything like what I've experienced. But I do know of your family tragedy. Perhaps you may know what it's like. 
Damn it. Should I do that what to Harley? Caught? Send to prison. What happens to your wife then? What do you propose? I own technology companies, Victor. Big ones. You could house and protect her. Continue your research to I'm cure lying. her. Why? Why would you do this? Oh, I'm not doing it for nothing. I expect a full return on my investment. <laughs> Practical. I respect that. I'll talk to Bane. Make sure he thinks you're on the level. You have my word. I may have misjudged you. Thanks. Any tips on handling Bane? I don't know. Go talk to him. <laughs> I don't Good know. Luck. I have to admit that what Mr. Freeze in I can't risk tampering with it. Um Mr. Freeze is hotter in Arkham. This is actually a very cool hideout. Guys, do I go up here and say I'm sorry about your dad to Harley? <sighs> if this is a mistake, I don't know. But why is it an option? Why is it an option? Hey, Brucey, come hither. Brucey, uh -huh. what is it? Listen, I know about your father, about how you tried to help him. He was a lost cause that made himself a shotgun lunch. Oh, what's that got to do with the price of tea in China? You trying to get in my head, Bruce? See, that's what I was afraid of. Look, I lost my parents too. I know the story. Everyone in this goddamn town knows the story. But don't make you president of the Dead Parents Club. If I wanted to talk about my pop, I wouldn't have had those records hidden. Which brings oh. me to thinking, how the hell would you know a thing like that? You snooping around my private life? You got some inside track I don't know about. It wasn't exactly a secret in Arkham, Harley. People talk, especially when they're out of their minds on meds. That's right. Impressed. stint in the loony bin. Still friends? Yeah, still friends. To be honest, I'm impressed you found that out. Just don't bring it up again. Okay. See, that was my fear. Um, that really was my fear, that she would pull a gun on me and be like, how did you know that? Are you trying to manipulate me? <laughs> Literally. But I was scared of. Uh, but she's impressed, so that's good. I think overall it was good. Um Oh, this is is Stunt House. I see end. Oh. Um Hey buddy, it's always so good to see you. Oh. Like, so good. Always good to see you, John. Oh. Oh, we you and framed our Oh, Good. Hey, I'm just glad everything worked. <laughs> Ever <laughs> handing that key over to Harley, giving her what she wanted. <laughs> Pure ecstasy. Aww. It, yeah, it was a big moment for Aww, me. Oh, I feel like he's I being abused by right her. Pinky sweared that everything would work out great. Harley wants me to try to get in good with Bane and Freeze. I think you're well on your way to doing just that. And I've been doing you know, what I can to uh, help, too. You didn't catch it? I did. It looked like Bane might kill you. I set off that EMP, you know, as a distraction. Yeah. I might give you a chance to show off your technical skills in front of Freeze. That's the only thing I think he really respects. 
Wow. Don't Chloe, remember this. I owe you my life, John. Don't remember that. It's what pals okay, do. Okay, okay, good. I know you do the same for me. And wouldn't you know it, you nailed it. You already know I like you, Bruce. You better get cracking on getting those other guys to like you, too. I can't with the framed so picture. Have to watch what happens if they don't. <laughs> Who was there before? Who was that? Who was that? Just a random guy? Okay, honey. Oh. Prisca. Bane loves that beer. I got uh, something from him. Talk to him. Yeah. He's scarier than anybody in Arkham. How would this be going if we like refuse to be friends with John? Oh, I'm so curious. <laughs> Did you have one here? Oh, that spot was for Batman. Oh. <laughs> you like Batman. <laughs> What's not to like? I only saw him for a second in Arkham, but <laughs> Oh man, I'd, I'd love to see him again. That's so sweet. <laughs> oh. I think she really brightens up the room. A thousand She's watt like... face. <laughs> How'd you two meet? Same way you and I met. In Arkham. She found me at a dark time and gave me a reason to live out here and experience all this. I don't see how we aren't destined to be together. <laughs> wouldn't make any sense. He's really lost. This is sad. Because I, I feel like she took advantage of him when he was in a low, vulnerable state, which is what abusers do. I hope I don't get any shit for it, but men can be victims too. Um, and like, he even said, I was in a low place, a dark place. And the fact that he's so attached to her, it's just what happens. And she knew what she was doing by getting him, I don't know, like stringing him along. It's sad. And usually Harley is the one that's like so obsessed with him and he's the one that's so obsessed with her. What the hell do you want? Bane doesn't want us talking to him. Get out of here. Okay, geez. EMP shielding. This material will keep whatever it's insulating from being affected by the EMP blast. I'm scared. Venom Lab. Can I look at this? I'm gonna get in trouble. And now I see where Bane gets his fashion sense. Okay, get beer. Just thought you looked thirsty. Wait, what if she finds that USB drive? Oh, he was like, yes, I am. Please, come. Uh, <laughs> really? Oh. Um. Riddler, he bombed your building and killed your friend. Someone did that to me. I bombed their building, kill their friend. I know you aren't friends with As Riddler. Riddler's friend, oh. I have to know. Are you here for payback? That's very smart, did though. Did you come for revenge? Answer me. Or I will break you in half. Riddler is dead. Any revenge I wanted, I already got. He did not deserve such an end. But you have a point. In this line of work, one cannot be too careful. Trust has been the hardest thing to find. Especially after Riddler's death. 
Yes. Men you can trust. Uh oh. So hard to find. Is this gonna be me budging up my morals? He was with my crew at the police arsenal. Hey! The prisoner he was supposed to be guarding got away. And yet he doesn't have a scratch on him. This is um, crazy! I does. suspect we have a traitor among us. What? One begins to smell a rat at the Riddler's murder and that prisoner getting away. Loyalty is all that we have. But there can be no trust unless I can believe that you are who you say you are. Oh, no. That you are really willing to do all that you claim. <laughs> Only one of you walks out of here. You know me. The sooner one of you picks up that pipe and bashes the other's head, the sooner we can... Can I knock him out, like, Fine. ethically? <laughs> Prove it. Are you serious? I don't have a choice. Be brutal, be merciful. Was that merciful? I don't know if I chose in time. Very good. Maybe you do have what it takes to join our pack. The package is moving. What's going on? The job we've been getting ready for. It's happening. Good. I'm ready. Not so fast, the money bags. You're not in the pact. Not yet. Not till everyone votes. Oh! What do you say, boys? Bruce Wayne. He in or out? The aristocrat is not afraid to dirty his hands. <laughs> I say we add him to the pact. In. There may be more to Wayne than first appeared. You can be trusted. In. Bruce is strong and smart and handsome. Like, super handsome. It's nuts, you guys. And uh, where was I going with this? Oh! Right, right. I vote in. Well, aren't you, Mr. Popular? We got a majority, folks. Bruce is in you've earned a ticket to ride pal make sure that emp shield in is on those apcs i don't need she's any so smart <laughs> time to get that package i love her corset remember when we work together no one can stop us yes king when we work together the world yeah. can be ours let's go somebody grab that thing it's important Let's go hit him with the hind. Well, we'll see. 11.40 p.m. Midtown. Oh, God, this is scary. Oh, should I sabotage it? Wayne, How do they not see close. what's in his ear? Make your device ready. Will do. EMP primed and ready to go. Harley. Yeah, what? We have almost reached the target vehicle. Uh-huh. What? No. You no, are no. providing our escape. Yeah, Waller. On the move with targets. Yeah. Track the signal. Get your people here. Now. I've got your signal locked. Cavalry is on the way. Okay. Now we do this. I, I mean, okay, I'm scared. What? Okay, so you're in the GCPD. Wait, what yeah. in the? I gotta say, Bruce, now that we're actually here and it's really happening, I'm feeling some butterflies in my stomach. We have oh. an obstruction ahead. Both lanes, armored vehicles, service weapons at the ready. Do not engage. Now, Wade, do it! Wait, I'm confused. What was the hell is going on? HQ, do you copy? My gun, it's fried. All comms are down. Move! What am I gonna do? 
Carry the torch, Mr. Suit. Stay sharp. Secure the vehicle. What is the job? So that perimeter. way he's just down, you know? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Freeze! Open the door! Everyone, stay sharp and keep order. And I'll no sudden moves and no talk. Yeah, they're really, really powerful. Maybe that this is how Waller changes Strength. her mind and wants to like use them. Go on. Quickly. You're wondering what's in there. Why not for Yeah, I want to know what's in here. Please don't Back be like Gordon's girl uh, daughter, Barbara. What is it? No, no, no! Don't. Break it off! We don't have time for this. We're not done here, Wayne. I would not turn my back on him. Why does he want to? I'll leave this clean up to you, but hurry. Man, what is the in the car. box? Get out of here! Looks like Nora. Or Waller, are you turning on me? Who's that? Waller here. Let them have it, Wayne. What are you talking about? The package. Let them have it. It's not worth my agent's lives. You can't be serious. You were supposed to be here. That was my ride! Break out the artillery and disable their vehicles! Damn it! We can fix this all later. For now, just move it. Waller out. What? I don't wanna hurt ya. But I will blow your heads off if you make me. Eat concrete! Lights out! <laughs> Put up that fire on it. I'm gonna play whack a mole with their heads. I don't. It's, it's not worth my. Okay, so these aren't her agents? Head off main, head off Harley. I don't know what it. <laughs> Head off? Like, stop them? Lights out! Put up that fire! I don't know. I don't think I can do it with Bane. Head off. I'm gonna play whack a mole with their heads. It's a warrior's death! It's a warrior's death. Um. Vane! It's not a warrior's death. About this. Be careful not to get in my way. Okay. You're the cargo. I don't know. I don't know. <gasps> oh no! No 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 no! Harley, need to leave now. Fine. Mm. Forget you. No! You said. Oh. Oh, 
man, that was so effective. That was so effective. What is that? Is it? Oh, you did well tonight, Wade. Better than that yammering harpy. How could we leave her? We need to get Harley. Now! Impossible. She's dead or in jail. So we break her out! And if she's dead? You better hope she's not. We, we have to help her. She'll be expecting us. She needs us. We'll get her back, John. I promise. Great. Let's go. We have to go now. Right now. We don't have time to waste on her. But Bane, you said like the past was, was everything. Save your breath. We have the cargo. Let's get this over with. Like you literally said, like we have to work together and stuff. Oh. You'll regret this, Bane. Forget him. We have and then forget you. him like you're not <laughs> why am i so disappointed like i expected anything less <laughs> open the box i'm like disappointed in the villains but i always get disappointed with the suicide squad that they don't actually effectively work together what the fuck is this it looks like it could have a body what if it's like robin oh It is sad to see a legend so, but there is no other way. At least now, we finally have everything we need. What do you Riddler mean? Riddler will open the path to us once the thief brings the last piece. I'll open any path for the right price. Um. I don't know what head off means. You and 39.8% of players left Harley feeling angry. Uh, oh, you fought with Bane. I thought it meant like you were trying to get her. Um, I thought you were trying to get her to stop fighting, you know? You and 39% of players left John feeling sad. He was overjoyed when you pinky sword never lie again. He was excited by the violent way Willie was handled. But because you let Harley get... I didn't let him! You and 81% of players left Tiffany feeling worried. Okay, she's concerned for yourself. 99.8% left Waller feeling confident. Yeah. No! He was ashamed when you need noticed he needed to rest. Fifty point one percent of players convinced Tiffany to hand over the phalanx key. How could I have whoa? Seventy one percent reached out to Gordon. What did I do? Uh, it took Willie down, down when he drew a knife on John. On John. 15%. Oh, peacefully. Calm down Willie with a drink. And then they had to take him down violently. Oh my god. Um, you and 57% of players attempted to minimize casualty. Yeah, that's what I thought. It was not like fight alongside. I really was worried about Bane and how many people he was killing. <laughs> you and 95% of players accepted John's offer of a pinky star becoming friends for life. Whoa, I wonder what the, how you determine the um, handing over the phalanx key. Oh, that was crazy. This is so good though. Like it is just so amazing to me. Um, I love these interpretations of the characters. I feel like this is how you do it. This is how you make 
a really good Batman game that's not just like copying a movie or a comic. Like, I love the Bruce, I love the Batman, I love the Jim Gordon, I love even Waller. I was like, damn, okay. I loved so much that Joker was like making a therapy group. Sorry, John, <laughs> he's not Joker yet. Um, I am curious to see if it's inevitable if he, if he becomes the Joker or if it's like a choice or or what um but again it's just interesting because usually joker kind of helped create harley quinn i think harley quinn was always in harleen quinzel um but you know she follows him sort of and like becomes his right hand man or like she originally in the animated series was just one of his thugs and she was so iconic they arlene made that character like it's so cool um but yeah they switched it around so it's like the joker might be dependent on harley and i am a little worried that i got her like arrested or taken away it's like i half love that but half hate it like Part of me is really like frustrated because that's not what I meant. I thought I was trying to like decrease the number of casualties and chaos that each of them would do. And so I thought Bane was going to absolutely like annihilate everyone in his path, which he kind of already did. And so I was like, okay, you know, and then it turned out to be like, who would you fight alongside? Which, you know, part of me is mad because it's like, you didn't tell me. But then the other part of me is like, oh, that's really cool. Like, that's exciting. You know, there's not, I don't know what's going to happen. And you tricked me a little bit, or at least um, just like you made it kind of spontaneous and chaotic and such. So I'm not really sure. Like, I definitely want Harley content, if that makes sense. Like, I want, if she does disappear, like, I'm not above replaying the entire episode again just to make sure that we get her in the next episodes. Um, but like, that's just, it depends. Like, you can tell me to worry or don't worry. I feel like a lot of you guys know me and <laughs> know what I would want. Um, I'm, I'm really not above playing the whole thing again to change the ending so I can get more Harley content, but maybe it'll be fine. Um, it sucked to see John sad, but, you know, if she does get out of it, then she gets out of it. Like, I, I don't think that I don't I'm not sure if that decision would affect every I don't. You can let me know, um, but you can already see the Joker kind of coming out, the laughing and she knows, too. You know, when he was in the elevator and he was starting to the laughs were bubbling up and she just kind of got alarmed and was like you know he's going through something or she knew that mentally he was spiraling or losing it um which was it was just interesting like the elements of the joker are there but then there are elements of just like a socially awkward but also like really loving empathetic guy because the reason he was upset about leaving Harley behind was he cares about her and he said you two are my closest friends um so like he was just really upset and I will say come on Bane you say like the pact it's supposed to be everyone's together but you just straight up left her behind I don't understand why they have Riddler's body or even if he's dead I don't know. I'm excited to see Selena, but I'm also just like, how is she going to fit into this? I knew that she would either take a job or um, like she's she works with them sometimes. She's like her. She's a lone wolf, a lone cat. So I wasn't shocked to see her, you know, oh, yeah, here I am to do my part of the job. Like that's that's Selena Kyle for you. It's gonna be interesting how she feels about uh bruce's relationship with john and harley um 
it that was just so fun i think for me a huge part of why i love batman is the relationships and the characters and so this is a dream come true this season and also the first season but like telltale their interpretation of this is so fun for me it's a dream come true because i get to experience like okay what if Bruce met Joker before he was Joker. Could we prevent the Joker? Like how much will Bruce believe in people and humanity to be rehab rehabilitated or just appreciated enough that they don't turn into the dark side of themselves? Um, what if we flip the switch and Harley actually had the power in the relationship and not Joker? Um, what would that look like? What would it look like if Batman and Catwoman actually really, you know, tried with their relationship. And it's just like a really cool role playing game. But then also the quick time events just make it so fun. Like I want to play every Telltale game. I'll be honest, like The Walking Dead was a little too much for me. It was really depressing. I've heard great things about The Wolf Among Us and stuff. So I'm going to be playing all of telltale stuff um and just it's just so good and a what if like bruce wayne particularly not even batman has to work with like a an iteration of the suicide squad and what would that look like you know it's just it's taking a lot of what ifs for me and making it really exciting and i also want to say i have the comic white knight and I'm really excited to read it. I think I'm going to read it tonight because I've heard the general premise of it. And I'm like, oh, my God, I like I need to read it. So we'll probably do a book talk of that since y'all are interested. And we're doing so much on the reaction channel with Batman and stuff. Um, and also to reiterate, like, I love Bane, how they're de depicting Venom and Bane you know, really emphasizing it's an addiction and um, the needle marks, you know, it just, it, I dated someone who was an addict uh, for heroin and like, it just, it's, it's just accurate. And you gotta show that, you know, you gotta show that whether or not someone's abusing or whether whatever drug, like venom is a drug and I just thought it was such an impactful decision to show the green veins and to show like the come down. And I didn't even know that Bane was supposed to be um, like Latin American or anything like that until the animated series. I had watched the third Christopher Nolan Batman movie um, and played the games and stuff. I just had no idea. And so I love that they honor that and that that's the original version of him in the comics. And um, the gang, like the gang aspect and, you know, he loves his beer. I just really, really, really love Bane. I'm like, are you guys gonna give me some of my favorite interpretations of these characters? Like I would say even Thomas Wayne, that's my favorite Thomas Wayne. Just because of course like that's how a lot of old money is inherited even though i do think that the waynes um from what i had heard from alfred i think the waynes before thomas weren't unethical um i don't know how rich they were but it seemed like alfred said that thomas specifically was like the criminal and the generations behind him were decent but please let me know like fact check me on that i'm not sure um but to achieve that amount of money and then you're supposedly so invested in a city that is like so worn down and there's huge wealth inequality i also really like bane as a reflection of bruce and batman because you know even seeing this episode highlighted the mirror between the two of them because some could, would argue that batman is like an addiction for bruce you know it depends on the way you look at it he, like he comes home and he's 
beaten and bloody and he is putting Alfred through a lot of stress. I hate, hate that I left him ashamed. Like I didn't mean that. I understand how it was taken the way it was taken. I just like, I really do want him to rest. Like I don't, but I guess that's me as Megan. Like I, I don't want him to fake being okay. His hand is, is shaking the tremors and like, I've seen that and I know I've seen it myself and like, I just want him to rest. I want Bruce to rest too, but Alfred is older. Like I just, I really care about him. And I think, you know, my Bruce does too. So we'll, we'll stick with that. I'm just, I'm sad. I don't want him to be ashamed. Like I really tried to comfort him and he's grieving like his lifelong friend, Lucius and I don't know, like, I just, I wish there was a way that Bruce could, like, take other people on and not have to just rely on Alfred alone, because that's just what makes me sad, like, him doing the medical, like, the, he has to patch him up, he has to stay on call, he has to do all the tech stuff. I just, I don't know, I feel like he should retire. It's really sad. It's really sad. Um, I love him though and I love this Alfred I love that their relationship is the strongest I've ever seen in any adaptation because you completely remove Alfred's dedication to the Waynes, the Wayne Manor the Wayne family tree and you're left with him just loving Bruce as a person and that is absolutely gorgeous because they are not blood related there's no duty. He doesn't believe in that. He didn't believe in his parents. He just loves Bruce. And like, that is just so gorgeous. So gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Um, Harley Quinn's the abuser. I talked about that a bit. Don't at me. Okay. I am personally, if you know anything about me, I actually really appreciate when a game or story or media demonstrates a female abuser because I think it's not talked about enough and they're doing it correctly and ex really exploring it with her because she's got the smarts of her degree, her psychology degree. She knows how to manipulate, but she's also very broken. And to hear even Gordon be like, I feel kind of bad for her. I don't know, man, I feel kind of bad for her. I like, I love that. And I don't excuse her actions okay like i'm legitimately afraid of her <laughs> like i'm actually scared as someone who has been abused by an older woman like i'm afraid okay um but she is you know there's tragedy can twist a person so i feel like they just have it's a really cool interpretation i could talk on and on i would love to hear first of all if i should replay the episode in case i just got harley killed or arrested or something to if um like what is the determination of whether or not the phalanx key is given from tiffany like what is what is that um and then i guess three if you know i should replace or replay the episode if it's worth it because it affects like john and I don't know, like, you know my priorities. My priorities are John and Selena. <laughs> we'll see. Um, so let me know. And yeah, I think it'd be fun too to like replay with different choices as well because that would just be interesting. Anyways, I'll stop talking. Thank you so much to my channel members. You can definitely join the channel membership if you would like early access to videos, sometimes like few days before especially if there's a backlog um you get access as soon as it's up and it's three dollars a month you know not necessary at all thank you if you do it but otherwise thank you for watching to the end shout out to you and let me know your favorite character in this and if any of the characters kind of changed your view of a classic dc character um yeah. Oh, I was also going to say that I really, I love that John was doing therapy in a bar. I think that also explains why him and Harley get along so well. And 
like they're both interested and fascinated in psychology and stuff, but also he misses that structure. I, I live in America, so we have the worst prison system in the world, but I have thought like, wouldn't that just be nice to be imprisoned in Norway who have literally have nicer prisons than like my apartments in New York City? Just to have the structure, you know what you're gonna do in the day. You have the schedule, you have the group therapy, you have the like community service. So I get it. I understand, John. I love you guys a lot. Be well. I'll see you for episode three. Bye.